Here you can see this is Windows 11 Enterprise G Edition or you can say Windows 11 Government Edition. So these kind of things going on over internet and so many people are looking for it. So I am the one who just posted it on Reddit like Tech Sanjeet. As you can see here, so many people also making videos about telling or showing this Reddit post. So basically this is a Windows 11 lightweight version of version 2.4 H2. Someone just modified the latest Windows 11 build. You can also create your own ISO using this build. I already have a video on it must watch before installing Windows 11 version 2.4 H2. You can create your own lightweight Windows 11 or do a clean install. Remove all the hardware requirement, right? So don't fall into these kind of ISO which comes from an official, not from Microsoft. I strongly recommended do not install any third party ISO in your system. Otherwise, you will face the consequences, right? Because so many people don't do it for free. They do it for some their benefit like injecting some malwares in the ISO that is going to collect all the information and sending to them. So many things can happen. So basically I already did a video on comparison like a Windows 11 Government Edition and Pro and the best part is I did not found any huge difference. Someone just modified it but still they are not making huge difference from the official Microsoft Windows 11 right. So basically what you can do if you want the lightweight windows you can remove unwanted things by just giving 10 to 20 minutes by watching youtube videos i already made a video on that like how to speed up windows 11 so many people commented like yeah this was really helpful right so as you can see he just removed all things from here you will not get here any kind of uh, windows copilot and widgets all things are removed even not a microsoft age no microsoft store you will get here clean start the person who just created this iso removed all the things still it is not making huge difference here let me show you the resources usage cpu utilization is three four percent processes is 110 if you install the official Windows 11, it will take only 130 and 120. Memory uses 1.4 GB and if you install fresh Windows 11 official version, that is going to took like 1.9 or 2 GB, right? That is also not uh, making a huge difference. So basically the thing is, don't fall for any kind of ISO you get from unofficial sources. On Twitter, you can also see here Pirate Nation also posted this uh, and he also did not share any kind of ISO here because he knows it's infected ISO. So basically the thing is you don't need to install it. If you are very curious about it, you can just go and install it in your virtual machine. So okay guys, there is no Windows 11 Enterprise G edition or Government edition. It's a modified version, not recommended to install.